stab it. How is it back down to 5,000? Okay, there it goes, 6,000. That's only when I have the extra healing. Too late, your mother's dead. Fuckers. Why don't they despawn when the fucking thing's dead? I mean, the portal's open. I'm just gonna wait for them to be to deep out. where that one's facing. It's funny how they do more damage without their mother being alive, yet they do less damage with their mother being alive. That's stupid. Maybe not. Maybe it's just server lag like it is right now. character would stop targeting more than one fucking spider at a time when their arrows only have one on them. Yeah, it's just... Oh my god! <laughs> it is server lag, holy shit.
And my other character is way stronger than this one. See, I mean, it, it keeps switching between the two. It's like, seriously? Don't you dare. Don't you dare do that again. This game is out to crash in my face. <laughs> I know it's the same thing, just level 5. So. Funny how the axe says it does more damage, but it really doesn't. <laughs> it's just like, oh, okay. Why didn't that stun them? Better not be like Bloodborne where you have to be behind them. Cause then you're just being a copycat Elder Scrolls. Cause it used to be you didn't have to do that. some server lag duh started and pointed out still just I'm very annoyed by it that's all I mean look at that shit that's not my internet if it was my internet I would have gotten a you've been kicked from the server because of lag issues but no, it's just freezing up and shit. Why are you guys up? <laughs> what are they doing? Bro! Why does they act like I've killed these fuckers already? Alright, because I have. And then I needed to go take care of something. Oh, Kill me here. Alright, now go away, all of ya. I bypass those fuckers. <laughs> I don't want to deal with them, so. I mean, the NPCs have already read them as dead, so I don't need to take care of them. We were, well, stuck on, I guess, you could say. The one I almost beat before. Hey! Get down here! Interrupted. 
And I'm not saying they interrupted because they're just being a dick. I just said they interrupted. And they interrupted because it needs done. Well, my brother interrupted, so that'd be he. They, I, I mean they because my mother, my father, my brother. Well, not really my father, because he's doing some. But my mother and brother needed my help. So that's why I keep saying they. Hello, ya daft fucks. Oh my god, stick to one target! You know, I might just go through this on my- Can you not push me? I might go through this on my fucking Dark Elf just to show you guys how powerful they are. Sorry, how powerful she is. I might not even be able to do the humans. It might be too strong for me right now. Oh my god, server lag! The hell, server? Might switch to European server just for this bullshit. I'd rather have my internet being shitty than the servers being shitty. Because there's too many people on. I guess we're in the middle of a pandemic. <laughs> like, seriously, people, come on. You know, do you have other games you could play? Nope, apparently not. Go play Skyrim or some shit. Be an asshole on that game. Go be an asshole in this game. Ah, I was prepared for the server like that time. <laughs> I also saw the heavy attack going. Instead of it just insta-casting. Oh yeah, oh yeah, I keep walking into me even though I literally can't get any fucking close otherwise your character model starts pushing me out of the way. Oh, but sure, keep pushing me. Fucking heal when I hit square, ya fuck. Fuck, it's ever lag. My god, stop doing it so slowly. I might just not. <laughs> I can't fucking do this on the North American server. It's just. The server itself can't even fucking handle itself. Oh my god, it's about to freeze. Oh my god, stop pushing me! Like, this server lag is absurdly high today. It wasn't this way yesterday. Yes, it was. I just need to fix this shit. Upgrade your servers. I know this isn't the PS5. And you're still having trouble with it. If you have trouble with the PS4, you're gonna have trouble with the PS5. It's just how it is. I don't like how my healing has variance to it. If you don't know what variance is, it's just like, it's got a minimum number and a maximum number and it's, it just picks a number between those and then that's what you get. Like this has like, I'm sure it's like 4,500 all the way to 6,500 and then the crits are server like can you stop 
Of course not, because it's a server and it doesn't have any intelligence to it. It's just doing what it's told. And running at what it can. <sighs> Stop getting on top of me. This boss is so annoying because of that. I don't think that's only... Server lag, can you fucking stop freezing my character so I can't do anything? That's also why you're getting in the damage. Because it's all happening at once because it's freezing up, locking up, and then resuming again. Just need to take out the main one. I keep moving because all they're gonna do is keep pushing me. That's gonna be super annoying to deal with. Oh my god. It's less annoying that I. My, that my character freezes and then does all the shit. It's more annoying when she just freezes and doesn't do anything afterwards. Every time they go for that heavy attack, it just fucking lags. In fact, when they go for any move, it fucking lags. Except for the standard attack. I fucking blocked that. Of course. Of course, my character's not doing shit now. Probably targeting some mob out in the Alkir desert where I'm not even close to. And that shouldn't even be loaded in at all. I... Oh my god! It did that stamina thing because I tried to roll. Stop advancing when you have longer legs than you have a fucking fighting range, for fuck's sake. I have 2,000 stamina, why is it... Oh my god, this game is so fucked. This game is fucked. It needs a re-release on the PS5. It just needs everything upgraded, is what I mean, actually. I don't want it to be on the PS5, because then I won't be able to fucking play it. And then I'll be stuck with this version. Like, I don't want to have to pay for a better version of this game on an different system or on this system. I just want this version fucking upgraded. Without fee. In fact, I want them to give me shit for all my troubles. Regardless of what that is. You know what? No. I want to be paid in gold for as many... T I want 1k for the amount of times I've been frozen up or my controls haven't responded correctly because of this game. It's still fucking good. Oh my god, do it! Not on the fucking baby! You know what, I'm, I'm not even going to finish this. This is, this is, this is hell to fight in with. So, um, yeah, I'm gonna end this here. There's not gonna be part three. I'm just gonna end it. I've done Spindle Clutch before without any commentary on my Dark Elf, but I really wanted there to be commentary without any server lag, but apparently my mic interferes with it. No, I'm kidding. That's not what... That's not what... That isn't what is happening. Mercenary style.
It's only when I'm fighting, too. It's never when I'm not fighting. Okay, now that's a lie. It happens all the time. So, I'm just gonna see you guys in another video, because this one is not going as well as I planned, and it needs... This is why I don't do ESO updates, because it is complete trash at running. It's like, come on guys, upgrade your server. Don't just sit there and keep it on the same version. Or if you do update it, don't just do a, if a couple of bug fixes. I want you to upgrade how well it can run. I want it to be like a... I want it to be as good, if not better than, the Demon Souls remake servers. No, 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 no. I want it to be better than... You, you know what game has a better server that, than this one? Final Fantasy XI, and guess how old that game is? 2002. For America. I mean... <laughs> If a game that old is better than a game this young, then... Well, I guess this is 2014, isn't it? Or 2012. But still, I mean... This, sh this should be better than a PS2 game. This is a PS4 game. Two generations past when it... Just the incompetence of America, my god. We may boast about how good our country is, but really, on the inside, it's a fucking shit show. I mean, it's not even the technology that's the problem, the main problem anyway. Yeah, the main problem is our own people who live here. And rule here, I guess you could say. Because that's how they act. <laughs> they act like they're ruling the place instead of running it. And yes, there's a difference. So, this may or may not happen, but I will definitely, if, if I ever get a computer that can run better, I'm definitely going to make an SFM... I with that, with uh, Trithin, the spy, and Jerry, the scout. I will definitely make some animations, but I won't start off with a battle because that'll just be throwing you guys, well, into the battle. <laughs> but I'll start with Origins and then lead on up to the finale of them to working together as a team but none of that's gonna be possible until I can get something better than a 2015 Asus or a 2014 Asus actually what was it 2013 No, I think it was when I was 13. It is a 2013 Asus, actually. Because 2020, I'm 17, almost 8. Well, actually, no. Almost 18 would be next May. So, end of 2020, so we'll just say... Seven years ago? That's how old my computer is? It's seven years old. So I was ten when I... Ten or eleven when I got it. Oh. Okay, I think it was 20, 2015. But the computer was manufactured 2013. So, yeah. It's a 2013 computer, but I got it 2015 when I was... Twelve. Maybe I was 13.
Yeah, it was definitely 12. So, <laughs> old things nowadays don't last that long. PlayStation 2 still lasts way longer than a PS4 ever will. And that is just a sad, 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 sad thing to think about. Because, I mean, modern day technology is supposed to be better, and yet it's worse. <laughs> like, sure, it runs better than a PS2. It has double the frames and double the graphics, but when it comes to long or lasting long, it doesn't really have that well it doesn't really do that well and the ps2 also isn't pushing itself to its limits and still having that stuff no the ps2 is like cash the ps2 isn't hard on itself it's running at a casual pace that's why the fans on it aren't like that's my ps4 right now now the ps2 might have had older fans so they were louder but those fans weren't working quite as hard as these ones are so I can definitely say that PS2 definitely lives longer than a PS4 also one of my PS2 still functions the one that didn't function is from was from Amazon and it uh, was tampered with But that one's the one that gave out. The one we originally got, it's it still works. And it's 2020 and it still fucking works. Uh, my dad just never brings it out because, again, he thinks it's just going to break down like the one from Amazon. Which is fair. I understand. Just like he doesn't bring out the... Oh yeah, that's another example. The Super, Nint Super Nintendo Entertainment System and Sega Genesis. Those two still work. I don't think they even had fans. Well, the SNES might have, but I don't think the Sega Genesis did. They might have. I don't remember. I haven't seen one in... 3-4 years, so... It used to be we could bring it out for a New Year's tradition, but not anymore. Although, also, we had an older TV that had that plug-in thing. Plug-in and play. <laughs> That's how we set up our Sega Genesis. But anyway, this game is just... Like, the system and the game on the system are terrible. Like, you could take Champions of Norath on the PS2 and play that. You could run your PS2 for days and it still wouldn't overheat. And the PS4 isn't like that. You have to turn the PS4 off every single day. And you can only be on it for like 12 hours before it starts overheating. Which, 12 hours is the whole time I'm awake, so yeah. Anyway, long story short, even though I already gave the long story, this game server is terrible. The game itself is good. It's well made. But the server is failing. It has not aged well. So, yeah. Same with the PS4. It has not aged well, it does as well. My PS3 still runs better than it does. Longer, I should say. Like, I can play Demon... I, I can have Demon Souls running overnight while I'm sleeping, and still wake up the next day, do all my daily things, and then go back to playing it. And it'll be like 4 in the afternoon. Pretty sure evening starts at 5. Like, that's how good the PS3 still runs. And I can't do that with the PS4. If I have it on, it has to not have a game playing when it's on. 
And that's like the least amount of work that it's doing. Is just having the menu open. And even then, I I can only do that for updates. And then when the update's done, I have to turn it off. But it isn't like that on my PS3. I can update and play a game at the same time. And I can also have a game running overnight while the update's going. And it'll be completely fine. <laughs> So, you tell me who runs better. PS4 might have more processing power, but the PS3 and PS2 are definitely built better to last. Not only that, but like PS3 is like two, three times the size of the PS4, so there's more space for the technology to be spread out, so it's not all heating itself up. Alright, this is PS4 Slim, so of course it doesn't last that long. But I mean, you're supposed to be better than your pre your ancestors, I'll say. And here you are. Sure, you have done more th better. Thi sure, you sure you've done more, and you have better things on you. But you yourself can't handle it. <laughs> like I'd have to get a PS4 Pro, which is the size of a PS3. And even then, that would still overheat easily, easily. And it's it has twice the amount of fans on it, I think. But I mean, you guys need to learn from your pasts, and you also need to learn from your mistakes. Which I hope that's what they did to the PS5. Because it looks like the PS5 is back to being PS3 size. Hopefully bigger. So it can actually air out. Like, I can have my PS... My PC. My old 2013... Or manufactured in 2013. Bought in 2015. My old 2013 computer. It, it could still run a game overnight like its cooling system is amazing because it's got a lot of air in it already and it's got fans that circulate said air in and out of its vents so it stays cool my ps4 it's like all compacted and there's no space in it and even if there is it's just a small gap with the PS3, you can tell it's still hollow a little bit, which is good, because then air can be inside of it and circulate it better. Like, smaller isn't better, but, I mean, like, you can still have your technology be small and just make the system bigger so you can have an air pocket in it so it actually circulates. That's why water cooling is better because it has room in it to have the water cooling. Now, I'm not entirely sure all of the pros and cons of water cooling. I just know that water cooling is usually better. But anyway, I'm sorry I've been ranting, but I, it just really bothers me that an older system can run a lot longer than a newer system so yeah I certainly hope they made the PS5 a lot better than they made the PS4 because the PS4 runs like a disappointment and that's not a joke it does not run very good like I could play the PS2 alright here's a good example I know, I'm ranting still, but I have to get this out. Here's an example. I used to play Chrono Cross and Tomb Raider. Well, I wouldn't do this on Tomb Raider, but I used to play Tomb Raider all the time. It was fun. Anyway, um, on Chrono Cross, since I... If I was in an area that didn't have a save point, I would just stand right there and go to bed. And then I'd wake up the next morning, eat breakfast, go to school. Or actually, I'd only live it on on the weekend. Well, 
sometimes I left it on during the week. I'd, I'd go to school, and then I'd come back, and then I'd do my homework, and then I'd hop on the PlayStation 2, and it'd still be on completely fine, not frozen, disc is still running, it's still the same now noise as it was the previous night. And it's perfectly fine. That's how good the PS2 ran with a game in it. This game, or this system is just like... And it gets louder and louder the more particles on the screen. <laughs> like the developers of the, those older games, they knew... Well, they didn't want to go all out with everything. They wanted to... The, pretty much they were dipping their toes in the water. They were testing it before they just fucking cannonballed in it. Clearly the people who made the PS4 or the PS4 games didn't think of that. They just wanted maximum performance on everything, including their games. And that's what's leading to the PS4's... Well, that's what's... That's just what's leading to the PS4's little problem of keeping itself at a low temperature for a longer period of time. So, they definitely need to learn from the PS3 and PS2. Because this thing... I think I got this in 2015, maybe 2016. And... By four or five years later, it's... Well, actually, four years later, because... Three to four years later, because it, it started to run terribly in 2019. Well, Elder Scrolls hasn't been doing this last year. It just boots people off. As you can see here, I'm fine. But when I go into the game, it's just like, Oh, you've been booted because an error has occurred with Elder Scrolls. <laughs> <laughs> But, anyway, like, again, please, do better. Learn from your past and your mistakes, and you'll make a better system. And I hope that's what they did with the PS5. I really hope they're not going to push the PS5 to its limits with its games. I hope they dip their toes in the water, starting with the best PS4 games quality. And seeing where it can go from there. And not exceeding the limitation. Or not pushing the limitations of it. Like they did with PS4. And also give it a better cooling system. Because small fans and little space is not the way you want to cool down a system. Clearly the PS2 and PS5 show that. Or 3. Sorry I said 5. <laughs> Clearly the, the PS2 and the PS5 oh, God damn it, I did it again Clearly the PS3 and the PS2 They knew they needed a better cooling system So they have a be like You should prioritize your cooling system Then how well it can run games Pretty much the processing power Well actually no It's cooling system Storage, like how much data it can hold, because clearly one terabyte isn't enough. How much memory it can put out. Like, we need to get one gigabyte memory. That's something we need. We're still in the megabytes, for fuck's sake. Excuse my language, but still. And the, the storage space needs to be at least... 10 terabytes of storage. When I saw 1 terabyte of storage, I was like, Oh, that's a lot of space. That's a thousand gigabytes. And yet, here we are, with all these games on the PS4, and it's like, You can't put any more games on me. There's not enough room. PS2. The hell, man? The fuck's going on here? <laughs> like, the PS2, you had memory cards. And I'm starting to think that's a lot better than just having what's on the PS4 itself, because PS2, it had cooling system, memory, 
memory cards. Now memory cards aren't connected to memory, they're actually just storage for your save data. And then I'll set processing power. Pretty much what you did, you'd turn on the system, you'd put a game in, well make sure you, actually you would turn on the system, put it in your memory, okay. Put in your memory cards, turn on the system, put in the uh, CD, because at the time they didn't have Blu-ray. Put in the CD, and it would just run, and then you'd go right into the game. Or you could just turn on the system, and you can go through your memory cards. And then you could put the game in, and then it would play the game. Like the PS1 games, they had long loading times. Yeah, because that what's that's what's on them. But well, with the Amazon PS2, it took a while to load. I don't know about the other PS2 because that was still connected to Dad's TV, and I don't know what he did with it. I think maybe he just had it to where it wasn't being used but regardless like the Amazon PS2 could still run these PS1 and PS2 games perfectly fine the PS1 games had longer loading times because they're outdated uh, CDs and they're meant for an older system that's another thing that the PS like PlayStation needs backwards compatible PS2 had that, guess who doesn't? PS3, PS4, and PS5. The PS5 has backwards compatible with PS4, but those are only certain games. And I don't think you can put in a disc and play. It's remote play. <laughs> so it's not even backwards compatible, it's just remote play. <laughs> oh my god, that's worse. Ugh. Like, I understand the PS2 was backwards compatible with the PS1 early in its development because it used almost the same CDs as the PS1, but again, at least both models of the PS2 could run movies and PS1 games. The newer model of PS2 and the older model of PS2, they, could, they were both backwards compatible. And then PS3 ended that. And then PS4 ended it. Even further. And the deny... Like... Either make these backwards compatible... Or make free remakes... Not remakes, but remasters on your newest... Or all of your systems. Just... Copy-paste that game onto there. Because then it'll just be the same as the game, except you'll be on a newer system with it. So you don't have to worry about your older system breaking down. But again, I'm ranting. So, see you guys in another video. Sorry for the ranting, but... Again, I'm just super bothered by this. If I was making a system, I would definitely make it the best I can. In all possible ways. Starting with the cooling system, storage, memories, processing power, and, of course, um, backwards compatibility. But anyway, I hope to see you guys in another video. Leave a like if you agree with me on most of the things, or if you just want to see more Elder Scrolls content. Please comment which you want to see or hear in the future. Otherwise, you'll get both. Because <laughs> I won't know what you guys want. And then I'll just do what I want. Because no one's told me or suggested anything from me. So. And consider subscribing. So I can work on SFMs and making my video game like I want to, but my memory card on my PC is outdated, so I can't use Blender and I can't use Unity, so I can't make that game. I can only use the RPG Maker 2003. 
because I don't feel I don't feel like paying for another RPG maker that's newer and runs better and I can actually import my own textures on because I don't have sixty dollars and we're in the middle of a pandemic so I can't go out and get a job even if it's part-time in fact I would prefer part-time because I'm still in school and then I'll full-time job for a year and then not ha or have a part-time job during college depending on how much or uh, depending on how long college is uh, depending on when college starts and ends as well because I might have a night job and then well I might not have a job because if college is going to be from 7 in the morning, which is really terrible, by the way. Why isn't it? Why am I? My question is, why don't schools for anyone start at 9? Why does it have to start at 7 in the morning? Like, the, the night predators are still hunting. But besides that, like... Here I go, but I've got to do it. <laughs> and get it out of my system again. Like, you need to start later in the day. Not only so little kids aren't being looked at like a fucking full course meal by predators of the night, but also so people... Or so your students can get more sleep so they're focused in class like you keep complaining about. Like honestly, you complain that we are falling asleep in class, but yet you have us starting at, at 7.30 in the morning. And we're teenagers and we need as much sleep as we can get. <laughs> like, make it 9 or 10 in the morning and end 4 to 5 in the afternoon. I mean, if it ends at 5, it's going to be a 7-hour day anyway. It'll just start later in the day. Now, the one class I don't mind being early in the morning is gym class. Because that's like morning exercises for me. Doubly over. But, I mean, like... The only class that I would like to have at 8... Not 7.30 in the morning. <laughs> it would be gym class. Because that class gets your blood pumping. So you're more prepared for the day. But even then you're still tired. Because your brain is still tired. Because it hasn't fully rested yet. And of course teenagers have bad habits of staying up at night. I should know. I am one. But even then I don't stay up past in the morning I know I'm trying to get my sleep schedule back on schedule but I wake up at 8 30 in the morning instead of 6 30 in the morning like I would for face-to-face -face school because let's face it 8 30 is still a better time than 7 30 but anyway I gotta do the outro again. Be sure to like, subscribe, hit the bell icon, make sure it's set to all, so you get all the notifications. Hopefully the future videos won't be as bad as this one. And hopefully I don't forget to post this one. Like I have so many others that I've just deleted because the content so bad is so bad. Which is sometimes I just wish I just uploaded the video immediately instead of just having it saved in the background somewhere and then it just doesn't ever get posted because I'm lazy <laughs> I'm lazy about that anyway mainly because I've got better things to focus on but even then like when I get on for video games what I need to be doing for or after that is uploading a video during the night while everyone's asleep which is what I'm going to be doing 
in a few moments here because it's because it is now 11:32 in the evening. Okay, okay, fine. I won't lie to you. It's 12:32 in the morning. Er, technically, yeah, morning. See, so yeah, I'm gonna end this here, and I'm gonna go to bed. Because I don't feel like staying up until in the morning again, and then not being able to sleep until four in the morning because my brain is fucking. I can't rest because. Da, 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 da. Really, it's just bullshit, so it can keep itself up. The fucking asshole. Like, seriously, I'm not choosing to stay up till four in the morning, just lying in bed for two or three or four hours. But anyways, that this video has gone on long enough, and I bid thee good night, or good morning, or good afternoon, whenever you're watching this. But it's good night for anyone who's watching it at night, and myself, because I need to be in bed, asleep. <sighs> I've been thinking of setting an alarm at 7:30 in the evening. Well, actually it should be 8 in the evening. So I can get 12 hours of sleep at least. Well, 12 and a half hours of sleep. So I can be ready for my 8.45 in the morning alarm. Yeah, part of me misses a curfew, but the other part of me doesn't. Like, right now I should have a curfew. Because, well, not a curfew per se, but I mean like a time to be in bed, so which is curfew. And, um... That's gonna be 8.30 from now on. So I can actually wake up at 8.45 and not be like, uh, I don't have enough sleep. <laughs> uh, that's one reason teenagers don't want to do anything is because they're too tired to do anything. Because their bodies are growing. And they don't understand that they can't run on 8 hours of sleep. They have to run on 12 or 14 hours of sleep. Because you're growing and you need sleep. <laughs> But anyway, I need to go to bed. Oh right, never mind. It's er, uh, it's now Sunday. But like, it's the weekend, so I guess I can stay up until like one or two in the morning because I don't have an alarm at eight in the morning. And I'll still wake up like one and two in the afternoon. So I might stay up for another half hour, hour. But I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna stay up past two thirty, because. Because frankly, that's too late. <sighs> but tonight, because it's now the next day now, tonight, uh, actually, you know what? I'm going to do it right now, right on camera. I know you guys are like, oh my god, just in the video already. But. I am going to set my alarm. One of them, anyway. Okay, I'll choose you. 8.30 p.m. Monday. We'll do Sunday and withdraw Friday. Because this is my going to bed alarm. Okay, alarm will ring in 19 hours and 52 minutes. And I left a message on the alarm. Go to bed. With four exclamation points. 
<laughs> I wish I had a webcam. Honestly, I do. But I need to get a job to buy the equipment. Oh, yeah. I also have an alarm set for 3 in the morning. Because, you know, 12 over in California. For Unis Honest. It's set to November 14th, 2021. It's a Sunday. And the message on it is Unus Anis Memento Mori. A memory of Unus Anis, Ethan Nestor, Mark Fishbach, Amy, and everyone who threw their blood, sweat, and tears into their passions. May their memories live on through us. May their perseverance be inspirational. It's not about the loss, it's about the memories we had with them. And that's the message I had attached to the OR. Arm will ring in 343 days. <laughs> so, yeah. Basically, it's a little, little alarm for the birthday of Unus Anas. And since it's on a Sunday, and it's the weekend. <laughs> Uh, then yeah, it's Unis Anis' birthday, so not much of a the Unis Anis annual alarm. <laughs> anyway, please just put a like on this video. Tell your friends about my channel. Not necessarily the past videos, because those are embarrassing, and so is this one, but I kind of do these when I feel shitty, and when I feel like recording something, because I don't really f feel like doing anything, and I also half-ass these, because, <sighs> again, I'm still, like, I've hit a second growth spurt, so... Most of these are gonna be like my entire Bloodborne co-op series is just be just me like, you know, I, I haven't posted on YouTube in forever, so I'm gonna make some back-to-back -back recordings of videos. And yes, I know, I kind of stayed up until three in the morning, and the videos started at six in the evening. Well, actually, no, it's four in the evening. So, <laughs> just me and Dragon Rider having a lot of fun together. Of course, he's an hour behind me, so he stayed up till 2 in the morning. He wanted to go for more, uh, after he used the bathroom. And then he got off for the night. But, um, actually, no, that was a different night. Never mind. But anyway, it was... It was a weekend regardless, but still, like, I just wanted to make videos so my channel wouldn't be like, Is this channel dead? Uh, no one cares. It never really had anything important on it anyway. <laughs> but I want to let people know I'm not dead, and I'm still putting out content, even if it's not very good content. But I don't have the essentials to make good content besides the video game, a mic, and a headset. Well, actually, the mic on the headset. So technically, it's only a few things that I have. And my SFMs are going to have to be 10 minutes long until... <laughs> you have been kicked for being idle. <laughs> uh, anyway, um, I'm going to end this video here, because ESO is getting impatient. <laughs> anyway... I'll see you guys in another video. And I have to do it, this in order, otherwise my brain's gonna forget and I'm just gonna say I'll see you guys in another video and then end it. I have to do the full sequence, I'm sorry. You can just end it here anyways if you want because I've already said it like three times but this is for my brain so I don't forget it next time when I'm ending a video. I'll see you guys in another video. Please leave a like on the video, consider subscribing, you don't have to, and if you do subscribe, hit the bell icon, make sure it's put on all so you know when I upload, and stay frosty. <laughs>